working with dynamic content and weights. Hello again, welcome back to H2 Kinfosys. Today we're going to learn how to work with dynamic content and use weights in Selenium with Java. Let's get started. Implicit weights. Implicit weights tell Selenium to wait for a certain amount of time before throwing a Gnosis Hellman exception. Here's an example. Import org.openclade.selenium.by. Import org.openclade.selenium.webdriver. Import org.openclade.selenium.webelman. Import org.openclade.selenium.chrome.chromedriver. Import java.util.concurrent.timeunit. Public class implicit weight. Public static void mainstring args. Set the path to the chroma driver. System .set property webdriver .chrome driver path to chroma driver. Initialize web driver. Web driver driver new chroma driver. Set an implicit wait of 10 seconds. Driver.manage.timeouts.implicitly wait 10 time unit dot seconds. Navigate to a sample page. Driver.get http colon double forward slash example.com. Locate an element that may take time to appear. Web element element web element element by dot id dynamic underscore element. Perform actions with the element. Element dot click. Close the browser. Driver, quit. This script sets an implicit wait of 10 seconds. Now let's use explicit weights. Explicit weights. Explicit weights allow you to wait for a specific condition to occur before proceeding. Here's an example. Import org.openk.selenium.by. Import org.openk.selenium.webdriver. Import org.openk.selenium.webelman. Import org.openk.selenium.chrome.chromedriver. Import org.openk.selenium.support.ui.expectedConditions. Import org.openk.selenium.support.ui.webdriver wait. Public class explicit wait. Public static void mainstring args. Set the path to the chroma driver. System dot set property webdriver dot chrome dot driver path to chrome driver. Initialize web driver. Web driver driver new chroma driver. Navigate to a sample page. Driver dot get http colon double forward slash example dot com. Set an explicit wait of up to 10 seconds. Web driver wait wait new dot web driver wait driver 10. Wait for a specific element to be clickable. Web element element wait dot until expected conditions dot elemento. Be clickable by dot id dynamic underscore element. Perform actions with the element. There element dot click. Element. Click. Close the browser. Driver. Quit. This script uses an explicit way to wait for an element to be clickable. In the next video, we'll explore how to create data-driven tests using testing G. Subscribe and stay tuned. If you found this video helpful, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more QA content. Leave your questions and comments below. Happy testing.